Question one find the quotient. Question A 18 divided by minus 3. So here we write 18 divided by minus 3. Now we divide 18 by 3. 3 6 are 18. Therefore remainder is 0. So our answer is minus 6. Now question B minus 90 divided by minus 7. Here this minus and this minus cancel. Finally we divide 98 by 7. 7 1 the 7 and to bring down 8 is also bring down 7 4 the 28. Therefore our quotient is 14. Again minus 126 divided by minus 42 sorry minus 42 now this minus and this minus cancel and finally we divide 126 divided by 42 42 into 3 equal to 126 therefore remainder 0 so finally quitting is 3 here we write 3 3 is our answer again question d 0 divided by 36 therefore 0 divided by minus 36 so when we divide 0 by any number then the answer will be 0 and 0 is neither positive nor negative therefore our answer will be 0. Again 102 divided by minus 17. Here we divide 102 by 17. Then uh, 17 into 6 equal to 7 6 are 42 2 carry 4 6 on the 6 plus 4 equal to 10. Therefore remainder is 0. So our answer is minus 6. Minus 72 divided by 36. Uh, so we need to divide 72 by 36. So 36 into 2 equal to 72. Therefore remainder 0. So our answer is minus 2. This is our answer. Here we write minus 52 divided by minus 26. So this minus and this minus cancel. When we divide 52 by 26 then we get 2 therefore our answer is 2 or you can write positive 2 anyone you can write both are correct answer minus 38 divide here we follow but must rule therefore minus 19 and plus and minus became minus 19 so minus 38 divide 19 minus 19 minus equal to minus minus 38 now minus 38 by minus 38 so here this minus and this minus cancel 38 and 38 cancel and the answer is 1 therefore 1 is our answer here we write minus 49 divide 7 into 7 equal to 49 so plus and minus became minus and finally we, we write 49 by minus 49 so this minus and this minus cancel when we divide this 49 with this we get 1 therefore our answer is 1 answer 1 or positive 1 d minus 101 divide here we solve this part at first because here we follow Bodmas rule therefore 9 minus 99 plus 98 so when we subtract this from this we get minus 1 minus 1 and now 101 divided by minus 1 finally this minus and this minus cancel and the answer is 101 because when we divide 101 by 1 then the answer will be 101 so answer is 101 or positive 101 e 117 divided by 2 plus or minus become minus so 117 divided by plus 1 and the finally answer is 117 so answer is 117 or plus 117 8 into 7 equal to 56 minus and minus became plus divide minus 10 plus and minus became minus 4 so 56 divide minus 14 so 56 divided by minus 14 when we divide 56 by 14 we get 4 so our answer is minus 4 answer minus
minus 4 minus 81 divide here we write minus 27 by 3 3 9 the 27 so therefore minus 81 divide minus 9 finally minus 81 divided by minus 9 this minus and this minus cancel 9 9 the 81 so our answer is positive 9 so we can write our answer 9 or positive 9 question h here we divide minus 120 by 40 so and write minus 3 so 4 3 is a 120 therefore minus 3 remain and uh, minus 3 here so minus 3 divided by minus 3 minus and minus cancel 3 1 the 3 therefore our answer is 1 answer 1 or positive 1 there is 1 therefore when we divide 1 minus 1 3 9 by 1 3 9 minus 1 3 9 then our answer will be 1 therefore our answer is minus 1 3 9 and when we put here 0 then the answer will be 0 answer is minus 1 so here present 2 7 2 therefore we need to divide minus 2 7 2 so when we divide 2 7 2 divided by minus 2 7 2 then our answer will be minus 1 so here answer is minus 2 7 2 again our answer is 4 question e so here we write 12 divided by minus 3 then our answer is minus 4 so we put here minus then our answer is positive 4 so the answer is minus 12 answer is 3 therefore when we put 9 then uh, minus 27 divided by 9 equal to answer is minus 3 then we put here 1 minus sign then this minus and this minus cancel then the then our answer is positive 3 so the answer is minus 9 for verify that here we solve left hand side at first left hand side equal to minus 48 divide 12 divide minus 4 bracket close so minus 48 divide 12 by minus 4 4 3 is a 12 therefore minus 48 divide minus 3 again minus 48 divided by minus 3 this minus and this minus cancel so 3 3 into 16 equal to 48 therefore answer is 16 right hand side RHS equal to minus 48 divide 12 bracket close divide minus 4 so minus 48 divided 12 divided by 12 divide minus 4 so 4 into 12 equal to 48 therefore minus 4 divide minus 4 so minus 4 by minus 4 so this minus and this minus cancel 4 1 the 4 therefore answer is 1 here we see left hand side does not equal to right hand side so verified here we solve left hand side at first left hand side equal to minus 24 divide minus 8 plus 6 minus 24 divide minus 2 now minus 24 divided by minus 2 this minus and this minus cancel so 2 2 1 the 2 and 2 2 the 4 therefore 12 is our left hand side value so we need to find the right hand side value so here we solve the right hand side so rh is equal to minus 24 divide minus 8 plus minus 24 divide 6 so at first we do 
divide so 24 divided by minus 8 plus 20 minus 24 divided by 6 so minus and minus cancel so 8 3 is a 24 so 6 4 is a 24 again 3 plus bracket minus 4 so 3 plus and minus became minus 4 so finally answer is minus 4 here we see left hand side does not equal to right hand side so verified left hand side equal to minus 100 divide bracket minus 4 plus 2 again minus 100 divide and the value is when we calculate this value we find minus 2 therefore minus 100 divided by minus 2 so this minus and this minus cancel and 250 equal to 100 so 50 is our left hand side value now we find the right hand side value RHS right hand value right hand side so minus 100 divide 4 minus 4 bracket close plus minus 100 divide 2 so minus 100 divided by minus 4 plus minus 100 divided by 2 so minus and minus cancel 425 equal to 100 so here 25 is our value and plus 250 equal to 100 so minus 50 so 25 plus and minus became minus 50 so finally the value is minus 25 here both are opposite therefore left hand side does not equal to right hand side therefore verified